What's up everybody, this is at Kiban here. Now in today's video, I'm going to show you how to use an online editing software for free and it is amazing. Let's go to our browser. What I want you to do is I want you to type photo p.co uh, i'm going to leave it in the description for you to use click on enter and you might have heard of this software before now you can see these are all the extensions guys this software is crazy and it is free we have two options you can click on your file and then bring in your image open to bring your image or even create a new image or you can go and simply drag it into the software i am going to use this hold it and then drag it all the way into the software we just have to wait a little minute now it's here interesting thing is guys this software or this online platform you can use it on your phone and you can also use it on your pc or desktop it is compatible both on your phone your ipad every machine or every device you are using this is compatible with it and it's also similar to photoshop you can see all your tools are at this place your menus are almost similar and then your tools options are also here also similar you can click on your move tool now let's click on b b picks the brush to v v picks the move tool that means that the shortcuts are also almost similar control plus to increase it control minus to decrease it the shortcuts are also similar so if you are somebody who is using photoshop you can also use this because it's the same thing except that this is free and you also have all these stuff at this place you can click on your properties click on the info um you know the brush settings here the text or the character the paragraph and then all these stuff the image galleries are all here the channels the path all these things are to your, your swatches your history guys this is amazing and you can also come um, below to this place you can click on this to delete it click on this to create a new uh, new layer you can see new layer you can click on this to also group it and then you can click on this icon for your adjustment and then your masking over here now let's click on the adjustment layers you have all these options to customize your image you can pick the hue and saturation and then the hue and saturation this is what you're going to do with it you can use the hue and saturation exact hue and saturation you have in photoshop you can come to master and then set it to yellow now i'm using yellow because there are a lot of yellows in there i just want to tweak the yellow so I'm going to drag the hue there and then the yellow will begin to change to green or to any color that I want. You can keep on dragging it until you get the color that you are looking for. That blends nicely. But let's drag it down a little bit. Let's see. Okay, so let's say we are going, we are going with this. And so this is what I love about it. Now there are more options there. We have all these effects here that you can use color fill um levels uh, i mean exposure vibrance we have all these stuff that you can use guys and last but not the least you can you see we also have the opacities and everything guys everything we have all this stuff here now you can also go to the file and then you can save it here and then guys you can also share it here guys you can also save it as psd that means that you can save it and use it in photoshop you can save it and then now open it in photoshop and continue your editing because it's totally compatible with photoshop you can also go to save more and then save it to these locations you can also go to export as and then save it as png save it as jpeg you can also save it as gif save it as pdf this software is amazing i'd like you to try your hands on it if you cannot afford photoshop or you don't even know how to get photoshop um you can use this one for your quick projects for your phone work everything guys see you in the next video give this video a thumbs up and then comment as well